right, everyone. Uh, early chapter today. I mean, it's like 8 o'clock. That's early for me. I'm normally not awake at 8 o'clock. I literally just woke up like 5, 10 minutes ago, saw that the chapter was out. I was like, okay. Uh, guess, guess I'm doing, this is the first thing I'm doing this morning. So, uh, last week's chapter ended off with a really, a really, uh, big reveal that Stussy was a clone of someone from the Rocks Pirates, Miss Buckingham, Miss Buckingham Stussy, and, uh, in my mind, that just confirms a lot of things, uh, like, Weevil, Weevil's mom is basically, like, was from the Rocks Pirates, and I think she tried to clone Whitebeard, and that's how Weevil became a thing. Uh, that's what, I, that's what I think. There's, like, more going into details, but I just want to get into this chapter really quick. Uh, chapter 1073, Miss Buckingham Stussy. Uh, let's get let's get into this chapter. Uh, remember, if you like these types of videos, uh, if you like if you like One Piece in general, uh, maybe like and subscribe to the videos. And uh, let's go. Chapter ten seventy three. Miss Buckingham Stussy. German sixty six is cold blooded voyage. Volume twenty nine. Awarding the I Bell Peace Prize for developing the GP flower, a flower that blooms in gunpowder. Isn't that a thing in real life, kind of? Like, like scientists are trying to do, like, gun shells or bullet shells that, uh, that decompose so it's, like, not, like, littering the ground or whatever. And you can see Vegapunk, uh, with his smiling, he's, like, talking in front of a mic, and Queen, Caesar, and Judge are all like, what? What? Then there's these two guys in tanks behind him, I guess, like... Interesting, interesting. Alright, let's get into the chapter. Lucci's betrayal to... Re reaction to betrayal. Kaku! This is a bitter pill to swallow. Yeah, Kaku got put to sleep by, uh, by Stussy. <laughs> Paper arts. Heartbreak after image. Ooh, Stussy and Lucci are fighting. Ooh, okay. So when you don't understand, your first instinct is to go for the kill. My, my. You're so wild. Sea stone? What is, what is Stussy's power? Is she, is she, is she a vampire or something? And she bites down into Luchi's neck. And the, the pigeon Hatoru is going, coo, 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 coo. You bitch. I know how strong you boys are. Fighting you fair and square would have been stupid. Forgive me. <laughs> what? Brooks just shocked. What? Just a moment. What is this? Why are the CP0 agents at each other's throats? Good one, Brooke. They're literally at each other's throats. Because Stussy is... Yeah. Friendly fire, huh? Alright, Zoro's kind of confused. This is Stussy. I put them both to sleep. That's fantastic news! Stussy came through! York, pull it together. Oh, okay. So, Stussy is somehow working for Vegapunk. Interesting, interesting. I mean, Kizaru's still on his way. Maybe we'll see him in this chapter. That's fantastic news. Stucky, Stussy came through and there's a uh, Pythagoras... Pythagoras and uh, York. York, pull it together. York's just yawning. Huh? What's going on? Rob Lucci was beaten. No doubt he was taken by surprise. Her loyalty to me was kept secret even after she spent 20 years as one of their agents. You had a mole in the intelligence branch? It wasn't our intention, but that's how it turned out. Doctor, unfortunately, my authority level is, at, is the same level as Lucci's. So I can't override his orders and stop the Seraphim. You've done plenty, Stussy. We're on our way. And there's uh, Edison and Lilith. We need to stop those runs before they flatten the others. Right, and is it just me, or do these those kids look familiar? 
I know, especially that one. Which one is Zoro talking about? Is he talking about Kuma or Mihawk? He's probably talking about Mihawk because it's the only one not shown here. Fooey, they won't stop blowing holes in the lab. Though I suppose we can use those extra exits to get out faster. And there goes Lilith, and I'm out. Hey, Seraphine, listen! Oh, there goes Mihawk. Oh, Sora clashing with the Mihawk, Seraphine! Ooh. Clash. On closer inspection, you're not the same. You actually have a spark of humanity. Okay. <laughs> Still, what the hell are you? That was a shock. Leave it to me. Seraphine! Quit it! Stop fighting immediately! Edison! Oh, there goes Sanji. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Jinbei... Jinbei... This Jinbei Seraphine launches an explosion at uh, Edison. Lilith thinks he died right then. But nope. Hmm? You looking for this? That was close! Sanji's just holding Edison like... <laughs> he just grabbed him really quick. Edison, the Seraphim finally listened. Can someone tell me what these things are? Zoro's <laughs> just like, wait, what? <laughs> Shaka, I found Luchi and Kaka with key with sea stone. Much obliged, Jesse. We were leaving the island. You should come with us. Understood. Hey, you can't keep adding people. Who <laughs> stops like? I do not want any part of this, man. Going to uh, Luffy. Hey, Bonnie, where'd you go? Old Man Punk, we can't leave without you. A truly unexpected development. Old Man! Dr. Ma Dr. Vegapunk's main Stella body has vanished. Sphinx, New World. Whitebeard's hometown. Uh. Ooh. Marco! It was so scary. Not for me, I wasn't scared, and there's just kids, like... Yeah. There were marines all over the place. And Marco's sitting on a log. I'm really sorry, kids, Yoi. I didn't mean to leave you in such a bad spot. It's not your fault, Marco. Those marine meanies were the worst. They said they were here for Whitebridge treasure. They were just like pirates. If you play nice, you won't get hurt, okay? Rem Remember, this place isn't government affiliated. You have no legal rights here. Whitebeard must have kept all his treasure here. This marine guy looks like uh, the mouse guy from Arlong Park. I forget his name. Yeah, Whitebeard must have kept all his treasure here. If you don't, if you don't tell us, we'll consider it an act of defiance. I could shoot you all one by one. And he's pointing a gun at one of the kids. If you think that'll make you more talkative. Th there's no treasure here. Stop pointing that gun at my little brother. You really won't treat us as fellow humans just because we can't pay the government? You monsters. And there's an old woman. Are you sure it's wise to act tough when Marco's not around? Hold her still. Yeah. Stop it. Please stop this, Granny. Oh, and he's aiming the gun at the old woman? Jeez. Steady. Please, stop this. She's just an old lady. I don't think these guys are actually Marines. I don't know. Hmm? Oh, hands off. Ooh, and Weevil? <laughs> just comes out of nowhere. Okay, we're getting... Weevil stuff? Okay. Stay away from Poppy's home. Captain Rattle. Yeah, it, it, it's Edward we Weevil. Warships were meant to hunt down the warlords, now they're disbanded. We lost all contact with the other squad. He got them all. What a strength, he's a bona fide monster. Get back to the ship, we need... Okay, we're getting a flashback within a flash flashback. Get back to the ship, we need to wait for backup. This is Sphinx, an ex-warlord just showed up, it's Weevil. Requesting immediate assistance. If that guy hadn't shown up, the village would be toast. What a hero. I'm glad you're all safe, you are. That wasn't the end of him, Mar Okay. Bunkin is here? That wasn't the end of it, Marco. Who do you think they sent in after that call for backup? None other than Admiral Ryokyuju. 
and he wasn't pulling any punches. Former member of the Rocks Pirates, self-proclaimed scientist, Mads resident freeloader, Miss Bucking, Buckingham Stussy. They've taken my sweet Weevil away. Get me my beloved son back. And while you're at it, fork over Newgate's inheritance too. <laughs> okay, Miss Buckin. Mads resident freeloader. Okay, so Ryokuju took Weevil? He defeated Weevil, I guess? Alright. <laughs> Weevil! Come on! You can see, like, Buckin crying on the edge of a cliff. And the edge of the... Navy ship going away. Sent sent to prison for protecting his father's village. Isn't it tragic? Don't you think our boy has a noble soul? Well, I appreciate you guys protecting the place at least, Yoi. Marco, I can hear it in your tone. You still doubt he's Whitebeard. Well, I know someone who can prove it. Dr. Vegapunk. Yeah, okay. All right. Weevil is a white beard, a failed white beard clone. Ooh. Kizaru san, we've pr prepared snacks and tea for our guest. I'm sure you remembered the test for poison, right? Of course, sir. I'll take it to him. Back to your post. Yes, sir. Marine flag, the world government flag. So, have you ever met Dr. Vegapunk before? Hmm? Whoa, 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 whoa. Once, a long time ago. I think what's happening now is truly such, such a shame. The highest authority in the world. One of the five elders. Saint J. Garcia Saturn. One of the bigwigs finally makes a move. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is the first time we've seen a five elder outside of that that room they have oh wait the only one above vegapunk who has control of the seraphims are the five elders ooh something something's about to happen and i don't know if i like it <laughs> He's got to have some powers if he's just leaving. I don't think he's just going to have Kizaru protect him. Oh. 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 Wow. 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 And there's a break next week. What? No, come on. Break next week. <laughs> oh, chapter notes for TCB scans. In addition to referencing the planet God, Saturn's name might refer to two unrelated musicians. Jerry J. Garcia, his name is very similar and he bears a visual resemblance to the character. There's also Russell Garcia who wrote a song called The Lost Souls of Saturn. And Rattle is named after the honey badger and okay all right uh, one piece just is so good every week every week i guess these guys were marines then because how they get to call ryokuju they didn't look like marines i'm just saying that dang i, I didn't I talked about Weevil in the beginning of this chapter. What is what are the odds that he actually showed up? That's that's crazy. Yeah. I think this is my thoughts about Weevil. I think uh they tried to clone Whitebeard, but they somehow messed up. In last chapter, uh Vegapunk said something about a a uh a doctor or scientist from the the West Blue, or one of the Blues, I forget which one. And Doctor Hogbeck from Thriller Bark is from, uh, you know, one of the Blues. I think it's the West Blue. Uh, so I think they they messed up somehow in creating a new Whitebeard's body. So, they had 
hog back, make a body, and that's why Weevil has all these stitches all over. And, like, he looks, like, misformed in some places, like, his arms. You can see a stitch going around one of his arms. Uh... Yeah, that's that's what that's what I think. That's why he, he looks so strange. Ooh, this is this is cool. One piece is so good every week, every every week, every week. Self-proclaimed scientist. Okay. I'm looking at Miss Buckin. Mad's resident freeloader, Miss Buckin, Buckingham Stussy. So this is like the bad version of Stussy grown up, I guess. And then again. <clears throat> so, Kuma, the Kuma Seraphim, and all the Seraphim are. Oh, wait, I just realized Sanji is right near the Hancock. Uh. Uh. Seraphim, I really hope they do not interact in any way possible. If you've seen film Z, uh, yeah, that, that I ho hope they do not interact for the sake of the rest of the story. Sanji cannot interact with the Hancock Seraphim. It was nice seeing. Uh, the Zoro, Zoro and the Mihawk Seraphim clash. That was, that was pretty cool. And, uh, you know. I think Stussy gotta, ha he's gotta have, like, a vampire bat. Uh. vampire bat uh devil fruit or something because how, how'd she get the fangs how'd she get the wings and how is she able to make and she she's just taking blood out of luchi how'd she how'd she hmm nice to know she didn't take out the pigeon though yeah that, that's cool all right i don't have anything more to talk about this chapter i, I I think this was a pretty solid chapter, like a really good chapter. I, I feel like that's hap that happens every chapter. We haven't got a, a bad chapter in forever, so yeah. Uh, I'm gonna end this video here. I hope you have a very nice day. I'm not gonna drag this out. See ya.